This is a demonstration of using PowerBot to link your email inbox with your Evernote account. I'm using Google Apps for Work and you can see my inbox on the left hand side of the screen and my Evernote software is open on the right hand side of the screen in the notebooks view. What I'm going to do is open up an email. This is about renting a personal wireless device whilst I'm in the United States of America. I've configured my email to be in conversation view and you can see that there are four emails, the last of which is from my assistant talking about a, a tripped entry uh, reminding me to return the MiFi. If I just open all these up, this is the email that I've received from the company confirming my order and it's got some phone numbers and it's got a hyperlink here and I'd like to have this information available to me whilst I'm in the United States of America in case something goes wrong. And the way to put that into Evernote is to use PowerBot. When you install PowerBot, you'll see this symbol up here, which is a little arrow going to a cloud. And to transfer this email into Evernote, all I need to do is click on the cloud and I get the PowerBot dialog box opening. You can see that there are three options to clip to. There's Evernote, there's Dropbox, and there's OneNote. Today I'm just going to clip to Evernote. And here you'll see in the title of the note, it's order received from XCOM Global, and this is the same as the subject line of the email. Here I've got my notebooks. I'm going to put it into my primary notebook, which is 01 Philippe's notebook. And here I've got some tags. Now I have a lot of tags, so I could scroll through these tags and go on and on and on and try to find what I'm after. But I know what I'm after because I organise my tags by event and I know that the tag for Tech Show begins with 2015-04. And here you can see the tag for Tech Show and I'll just add that and the tag's immediately there. I want to add a comment just in case I need to search for this and I'm going to add personal MiFi Wi-Fi and I, I could add a reminder if I wanted to but I don't need to add a reminder and then I simply press the click clip to Evernote button and then what you see is the gears working up here and this is clipping the order. Now whilst that's happening I'm just going to move to the other side of the screen and look at the Evernote account and you'll see my tags are assigned here and I'm going to open up the events. And down here you can see the uh, Tech Show 2015 event. If I click on that, you should see all the notes tagged. And at the moment, there's no note from my email. That's because I need to sync. I just go up and I sync the account. And if you keep a look here, oops, keep a look here, as the notes come down, you'll see there's the email that's just appeared. Now, if I double click and open that up, you'll see the tags be fitted up here. Here's a URL that I can click on. I'll come back to that in a moment. You've got the title, my comment here, and here you have the entire email. And if you've noticed, there are hyperlinks in this email. These still work. If I move my cursor over those, the cursor changes. One of the things I love about uh, Evernote is these URLs, and particularly using it with Google, if I click on the email box, you'll see that what happens is my email opens and I've got back to the original email thread, which is very useful. Now, I might want to capture this entire thread rather than a single email. I use this button here for this particular email and if I wanted the second email, I could use this button and the third email, this button. But if I want to capture the entire thread, instead of using any of these buttons, I can collapse the whole list and use this button up here. And this button will capture the entire thread. It works in exactly the same way. We've got the order received. Again, I'm going to put into my notebook. Again, I'm going to add the tag. I'm going to add a comment to erase me because I don't need this and it will cl clip to Evernote. Once again, it's clipping in a matter of seconds. And that's now finished clipping. All I need to do is synchronize my Evernote account. 
and then you'll see it's appeared straight away. Once again, if I open it, you'll see the information there, the URL, the tag, the title, and this time when I scroll down, you'll see the first email, and then you'll see this gray separation and a second email, and the third email, and the fourth email.